Team Kohler and uh, Salil and the whole team and my friends. It's a great opportunity to be here and listen to the masters and some of the things which they have done and could say they have done the best thing what, what has been exhibited. I'll, I would like to start my also. Art enhances built spaces and thereby our lives. Art is an important part of space making as it imparts a different flavor and perspective to the simplest of the spaces. The modes of expressing art have been changing through the time. Art interwoven with architecture is precisely seen in the buildings in different eras. Each and every element of this building speaks of the corresponding timeline. Art is the element which enroots itself in a space and adds to the exclusivity of it. Art directly involves the soul of the creator and influences the soul of the receiver. It signifies cultures, religions, and attempts to recover the values of the past. It strikes a dialogue with the viewer. Art demarcates the type of carvings, colors, fenestrations, materials, etc. of a particular place. It unconsciously becomes an immovable part of the built space as it gets embedded with the lives of the people. In the works of late architect Charles Coria, a strong synergy between art and architecture is seen. Murals, paintings and sculptures not only provides a reference to the local tradition, but balances the spatial tensions generated by the built form. They help the space to transcend the boundaries of architecture. The use of art for expressing the spirit of his context in Grand Hayat, Mumbai. The artwork are dedicated to the deities and archeological sites of Mumbai. The sculptures and the murals defines each space. The colorful wall art displays the Dabbawalas of Mumbai. The aerial view of Dharavi, the fast track life of Mumbaikers, and the glamour of Bollywood, all these aspects are portrayed through these artworks. The house of MG at Ahmedabad, where traditional art as well as the building elements are breathed of this historical house. The confluence of local and contemporary art works and the use of earthen colors makes the space more lively and vibrant. From the flooring to the walls reaching till the ceiling, the art emanates from this heritage building. The artistic approach taken in the courtyards and pool area gives a mystic charm and adds to the beauty. Now I would like to show a few of the projects which we have designed. A house designed for a doctor couple and art collector where the antiques and period furniture are interwoven with each other to create a houseum. The colonial facade, internal courtyard and all architecture element plays a symphony of art. All the elements in this house are handpicked from different sources. They range from minute carving details of a door to a large space defining elements. The diversity of Indian culture is juxtaposed to create a harmonious living space. All the elements, the house gets a holistic feel even within the remondas that exist. In the courtyard, a 250 year old and 24 feet high Jarukha was reassembled. The houseum, as it is called, as a theme of locks, clocks, and peacocks. This is a modern sleek house in Baroda where the indoor and outdoor spaces are embellished with wall murals in different media. It adds flavor to the simplistic house, echoing the owner's lifestyle and establishes a link between the spaces. Some of the interior spaces were washed with skylight while other spaces are treated with soothing colors 
and enigmatic murals. The color, texture, and play of sunlight refreshes the mind. A villa designed at Baroda, where the mural of Tree of Life is the central focus. The built spaces were wrapped around the central water body and courtyard. The nature-inspired design predominates the built form within the house. Now, this is the Alliance Church, Ahmedabad. The design of this church and rooted in the biblical truth. The concept of the design is based on the upliftment of the spirit from darkness to light. The floating roof, stone cladded wall, graphical glass wall, all pointing to the heaven above. The artworks are the spine of the church. They preach the gospel and educate them spiritually and silently add the beauty of the church. The miracles of Jesus portrayed through a collage of shilohs in the main foyer. The mural of the emerging cross is specifically created on the east facade, resulting the morning sunlight streaming through the colored glass and thereby the affluence of those colors elevate oneself to worship the Almighty. Art is engrossing, surprising, joyous, inviting, inspiring. It imparts beauty to the space. The relationship of architecture to the arts is crucial one. Art is an immovable part of one's identity, which gets overshadowed by practicality. We should be responsible and responsive towards the art because art is too important not to share. Thank you.